Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode 29 of Delicious Party Pretty Curse. It's gonna get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm -hmm. And of course, I'm guessing he's going to get trial, which would make the most this uh, spit, <laughs> which would make the most sense. Mm -hmm. We're all going. Mary. Oh my god! Well, I mean, you might as well try. Uh, well, we're going. See, I feel like they're going to show it's going to be the regular original opening. It's not going to be the other one because of the fact control. Yeah. Yeah. See, damn. I I would have wanted to see scenes of the movie, but of course they're like, nah, bro, we don't do that. Not here. <laughs> Did they cut? Uh, I'm guessing they did. Mm. 
Well, if they did, then it's a good thing I saw that scene on Twitter. And we'll talk about it at the end of the episode. It's pretty. Look at the strawberry! Oh my god! Cotton candy? <gasps> oh my god. Yui! Yui! No! Oh. Hmm. Oh my god, look at the good lollipops. Oh my god! <laughs> mhm. Mm ah. Oh, okay, so like, you know, cinnamon and black pepper, basically. Yeah, and those two, yes. Too easy. <laughs> Damn, I thought we would get a new eye catch today. Damn, I thought we would get a new eye catch today. Of course. <laughs> Sushi! 
that oh mm. <laughs> oh. oh good job come come eh Before Pamo Pamo. Yeah, you just look straight ahead. <laughs> well, yeah, there's a lot of things I'd be afraid of. Mm hmm. Bad guy. The fact that she is finally getting able to do ish because I thought it would have took forever. Like, at least by episode 31 or 32 for, like, the last half of this show. But thank God. Because she's she was the only one who didn't have a time to shine. And now she's finally getting it.
In a way, Sephiroth gives me, like, hella vibes to Venti from Genshin Impact, even though I have not played Genshin in, like, two years. (laughs) Oh! Mm. He trying, though. He's got it. Well, I mean, obviously, did she really think it was going to be that easy? Oh, good job, baby. Mm -hmm, You did good. Time to go home. Mm-hmm. <coughs> but mine time to go home. What's up? <gasps> <There we> go! <laughs> Yay! Oh my babies, I miss them 
all so much. That was perfect. So perfect. Bruh, because the only reason why they had them in this episode is because of the fact is it's the, from what I saw earlier today or about like maybe what, like an hour or two ago, um, there is at the end of the movie that's coming out today for, I mean, what, is it today for Delicious Party? It's coming out soon. It has to come out before next week because next month is October. Um, it's the little short movie that is going to have, like, you know, Precious, um, Summer, Grace, and Star. Nope, not Star. Twinkle. 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 No. Yeah, it's Star. It's Star, not Twinkle. Cure Star. Um, all together cooking. And I literally tweeted because they had a picture of freaking Manatsu as Summer. And I just like, I was like, oh my god. I was like, even though it is not a year of, you know, her as this, I'm pretty curious Jojo just seeing her again in this universe. Like, I'm happy because like, all oh, it, it's just always so weird to like, once a big Seiyu comes into the Pretty Cure universe and such, and then they're here for a whole year, and next thing you know, they, like, move on to another job. It's so weird, because then it's like, oh, hey, like, literally, she said something else, and then you're still watching her Pretty Cure. And then, like, this with JoJo, because your girl still needs to fucking catch up on JoJo, because I need to watch, like, the last couple of, um, I think, what, ten episodes I gotta watch, so hopefully I can do that Monday. But, oh, this is such a good episode! I loved it! The ending was the best part! <laughs> We're getting a Mary episode. We're getting a Mary episode. I think this is now number two. Thank you, God. Oh, my God. Because still, once again, like, Mary is such an interesting character. And ish, he gives me, like, how the feels to um, Harry from Hakuto. Even though, like, well, the difference is, you know, one, it, one is mm, and the other one is straight. So, obviously, um, you, you still want to know like so much more about both of them and such and so I, I i'm loving the fact that once again we're getting more backstory or like development on rosemary as a character but at the same time i'm like bruh like I, I cannot wait to see like what they're gonna do for him like later in the series because since we are officially past the halfway point for this show and we only have a certain amount of weeks left before well number one since we are getting into october that's of course if you've known um, however long that you've been into the Pretty Cure series, like, moi, um, this is when the leaks are slowly but surely going to start popping up. We're probably going to initially in the next coming weeks, usually kind of by my birthday, um, we're going to see at least something. We're probably not going to get a trademark for a name until at least December. So whoever is the next girl, I, I'm, I'm, one, I'm always excited for new Pretty Cures because pretty cure but at the same time just is like like the cycle of dr who it's gonna be the same thing with pretty cure where it's like i'm excited for a new group but i miss the old group i start liking the new group i get attached to them and the next thing you know it's been a whole year and we're doing it all over again with the next group and such um but yeah i hope we get to see cook kingdom again um but i'm guessing that's going to be more towards like the last couple of episodes of this season and such um but once again, thank God they didn't do, like, Hagato. I'm not Hagato. Healing Good, where it was like, oh, we're going to wait until, like, the last few episodes to finally go to this place. Like, because, bruh, that, to me, that was a little dumb. But I understood it's the time consuming, and especially with the situation of Healing Good and the fact that they weren't able to air their last five episodes or last four, and they had to get those, like, the show done very quickly. I completely understand it. Unlike with this in both, like, I think what the last couple of two, two seasons of shows for, so both this and, uh, 
Tropical Rouge. We're able to get their stories done like that, even with the situation of COVID, but I, I completely understand. But yeah, the episode was good. It was sweet. Loved meeting our new characters. Cannot wait to see them again. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 29 of Delicious Party Pretty Care. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all either next Saturday or next Sunday for episode 30. Bye, guys.